be doing something a little bit different and today I'm going to be trying Mexican candy. I've seen these videos a bunch on YouTube and I have been obsessed with watching them so I wanted to go ahead and try to do it myself. Um, I live in Texas so the border is literally right down there and it's super super easy for me to get Mexican candy which is why I wanted to start it as like my little stepping stone. Um, it's pretty easy for me to get British candy and Japanese candy too but they're a little bit longer of a drive to get to them. So I literally can just go to my local grocery store and get Mexican candy and there's like a big selection. Um, I took a video of it so y'all could see. But there's like a humongous selection of candy that I've never tried before. Um, I have tried some Mexican candy so I know what I'm dealing with. Um, I've tried some of like the lollipops and stuff. But all the stuff I get got, I have never tried before. I got a ton of candy. Um, this is probably going to be in two parts because honestly, there's so much candy in here. I don't even think I could eat out all in one go. Okay guys, so I picked out the candy I'm going to do in the first video. Coco Retas. They're green. They just look like chocolate. It's chocolate and artificially mint flavored candy. I want to point out that I'm not picky at all. So, when I'm rating these candies, they're probably going to get good ratings because I love candy. Um, they're mint. They just taste like mint and chocolate, but the aftertaste is a little bit strange. Um, but they're pretty good. I could eat this whole bag. Um, I give it a 9 out of 10. I love mint and chocolate, so those are pretty good. Okay, the next thing I'm going to try are Rellerindos. It says filled hard candy. That's scary. The picture isn't too reassuring. Okay. Let's see here. Um, they look like little peanuts, kind of. Oh, uh, wait. Wait a second. That, uh, um. Oh. Mmm. It's weird because it's like sweet and savory. It's like so weird. Mm. Ooh. Okay. Okay. One hour later, two hours later, three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. I broke into it, but there's no liquid. The picture shows liquid. I'm confused. Um. Yeah, so, I mean... Yeah, I mean, I broke my teeth, but there's no liquid in this, so we're just going to go ahead and stop eating it. I rate these um, an 8 out of 10. They're pretty good. I like them. Okay. The next thing we're going to try is the, oh, wow, Tilico Bites Sandia, which is watermelon, which is my favorite, or one of my favorites. I like cherry first, but... Watermelon's pretty good. Let's see. Um, okay, it's just like a little thing. Oh. Oh. Okay, first off, this doesn't taste like watermelon, like at all. Um, ew. It has like chunks of spices. Ugh. I don't really like it. Oh no. Okay, um, I tried a red one. Let's try a green one to see if it's any different. Probably not, but let's go for it. Oh! Oh no. That one was like way squishier than the first one. Like, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. It's so spicy. Oh! My mouth is on fire. Okay. Um, I'm gonna give those a 5 out of 10. I don't really like them. Nope. By the way, no offense to anybody that loves this candy. I'm just. I'm not that picky, but 
I don't like spicy things that much, so I'm weak. The next thing I'm going to try, I can't even pronounce. I La Napoleatiana. What? Um, candy guava roll. That's all we need to know. Um, not only does my grocery store have like a huge candy section, but we also have like little Mexican desserts that say like product of Mexico. So this is one of those. And yeah, I'm kind of interested to see what this is. Okay, I'm taking off a little bite. Mmm. It's good, but it's weird. If I was eating guava baby food, that's kind of like the texture. And then it's just covered in sugar. I guess it's alright. I wouldn't like sit there and eat it. Um, but it has an alright taste. Um, I'll give it a 6 out of 10. It's alright. I wouldn't sit there and eat it, but you know. Okay, the next thing I'm going to try is squinkles. I don't, why, why, I don't know what this is, but it just says, um, wow, chamoy flavor hot candy strips, I kind of do like chamoy, like when it's like covered in the gummy bear, or the, yeah, the gummy bears, it's pretty good, let's see, looks like this, mmm, it's good, I like these, I would eat the whole thing, I like the sour straws, Except instead of sour, it's like kind of like a spicy kind of flavor. Mm. I'm gonna eat another one. I give these a 9 out of 10. I like these. I'm gonna eat these. These are really good. Honestly, I, I would buy these again. The next thing I have is the Mazapan peanut candy. Um, I don't like peanuts that much, so we're gonna see how it goes. Never had this before, though. So, yeah. Um, let's open it. It's childproof, so that's just great. Oh, it smells pretty good. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, this is good. This is real good. It just tastes like there is a peanut flavor. It's also kind of vanilla y. It tastes like if you were eating like a peanut butter cookie dough kind of thing. I give this an 8 out of 10. I like this. I don't know if I get to eat it because it's pretty sweet. So I don't know how many of these I could eat. But it's pretty good for what it is. Okay, we have two things left. I'm going to try this next. Um, La Molinda. Product of Mexico. That's in English. I think there's coconut in this, which is good because I like coconut. It may also be raisins, which is not good because I hate raisins. Oh, it's very sticky. If you were eating like a macaroon, it's just, it's not flaky, like it's not hard and flaky. Like a coconut macaroon, it's more like sticky. I don't like raisins, but you can't really taste them in this. I've given an 8 out of 10. My mom is going to go crazy for this. She loves this kind of stuff. The last thing I have is Lucas Gastano. It says chamoy flavored hot liquid candy. How do I... How do I, um, oh, wait, something's happening. Oh, oh my god, some of that literally just landed in my eye. Okay, what? What is this? Okay, why? Um, what? They got some fancy, like, containers. Like, what is, okay, does it just, uh, okay, what? I'm real. oh, oh. Oh no! Oh my god! Oh! I don't like it. I don't like it. Uh uh. It tastes old and rotten. Okay, let's do it again. Oh no! No, no, no. Oh no. I don't like it a bit. I'm gonna give that a 1. A 1 out of 10. It tastes disgusting. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, give it a big old thumbs up so that I know. If you have any requests of things you want me to try out, make sure you leave it down below so I know. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can see more videos. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye!